Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Candice if you're new here and I make videos about slow fashion, motherhood, as well as some family vlogs. So if any of that sounds interesting to you, make sure to stick around and let's get into today's video. If you clicked on this video, you're probably curious what I have changed in my spring and summer capsule wardrobe. I've actually swapped some pieces out and replaced them for similar items um, and I've also added a couple of pieces. So if you watched my entire spring and summer capsule wardrobe where I walked through my entire process for creating it you'll know that at the end of that video I had about 30 pieces and I wanted to leave up to five spaces available in case I wanted to add any new pieces throughout the season first let's just go through the items that I've swapped and the reason why so I've been wearing this capsule for a couple of months now mostly through the spring season and a little bit of summer now that we're mid-june it's starting to warm up so I'm starting to really dig deeper into my summer pieces but the main reason I'm switching out some of these pieces is not because of weather it's actually because of fit so I am nine months postpartum now it's been a while but my body and weight have fluctuated so much in the last nine months that when I originally picked a couple of these pieces they did seem to fit but now I have lost even more weight and I'm finding that a couple of my bottoms don't fit me the way I'd like and they're actually very loose so I wanted to swap in similar pieces that fit me better for now so let's walk through those pieces all right so I'm gonna grab the pieces so as I mentioned it is mostly bottoms that aren't fitting me well. So I have three pairs here. I've been finding the fit is just way too loose. To be honest, a lot of my bottoms aren't fitting me the way I'd like right now, but I'm not going to just get rid of them all. These ones are the loosest ones. I have a pair of these colored linen trousers um, and they're just a little bit too loose. So to replace these teal linen trousers, I am swapping in a pair of these like burnt sienna linen shorts. I wanted to replace the items that I had already picked for my capsule wardrobe with similar items. So this is a colored piece, elasticated linen, but instead of trousers, they're shorts. These are by the Simple Folk Co. And they're really nice and breezy. They've got pockets. I like the warm tone color of them and they also fit me a lot better. And they've also got a drawstring in case I need to make it even tighter. So these are gonna replace those teal trousers and then Next up, a pair of jeans. If you watched my previous video, then you'll know that I had two pairs of jeans, one pair of high-rise jeans and one pair of mid-rise jeans. So I had these mid-rise jeans from Asket, which I actually really, really love the color and the cut and everything, but they just are too big. These actually fit me so well when I was freshly postpartum. And so I guess I didn't try them on properly and they're actually way too big for me right now. So I'm going to put them away. And to replace these jeans, I have picked out these ones by Boyish Denim. They are just like a straight leg fit, straight all the way through. And the wash is not as dark as the other pair, but they still are a really nice neutral base that I can pair with a lot of things in my wardrobe. So I'm replacing those mid-rise jeans with these ones. And then finally, I have these wide leg black pants from Eileen Fisher, which again, they are not fitting me the way that I would like. They're just way too loose. But I happen to have another pair of black wide leg pants that previously didn't fit me anymore postpartum. They were too tight, but now they actually fit me again. So I'm going to replace those black wide leg pants just with another pair of black wide leg pants that just fit me a lot better. And these are by Harley J, which is a Canadian slow fashion brand. So it's the same style. I'm just replacing them with a pair that fits me a lot better. Those are the three swaps. And now in terms of additions, I added a couple of pieces to my wardrobe. The first one being this top that I'm wearing right here. This is by another Canadian slow fashion brand called Free Label. And this one, I love how stretchy the material is. It's like a tensile material and it is like three quarter length sleeve and it is a wrap top. So it's super versatile. It can be worn many, many different ways. And it's also nursing friendly, which is a huge plus for me right now. So this is the first addition that I've made to the spring and summer capsule. Next up is another button down. I've been finding that I've been getting a lot of use out of the button downs that are already in my wardrobe. So I added this one from Tradlands and it is a cropped button down with really cute um, cream colored buttons and yeah, also nursing friendly. So this is another great top for me, especially in this season. And then I have added two jumpsuits because jumpsuits are just my go-to at the moment. I'm actually considering taking out my dresses completely because I just haven't really been wearing them. Jumpsuits and pants 
pants and shorts are just the way to go for me right now. So I've added two more jumpsuits. So the next piece is this really pretty breezy jumpsuit from Harley J. It has got an adjustable neckline. It's got pockets. It's really wide and comfy, easy to move around in, also nursing friendly. So this one is just perfect for me right now. And then finally, I've added one more jumpsuit. This black one from Alex Mill. It's more of a structured piece. It's got pockets and actually it's quite nursing friendly. So originally I thought this one wouldn't be really nursing friendly, but the straps come down really easily. And what I like about it is that it has a belt. So as I mentioned, a lot of my pieces weren't fitting me properly, especially my pants and bottoms. But this one, I love that it has a cinched waist. So it kind of, so I like how the belt kind of defines the waistline. So that is the final piece. So those are the little changes that I've made to my spring and summer capsule wardrobe. For me personally, I'm not super strict with my capsule wardrobe. If something isn't fitting me properly and I'm not getting wear out of it, I think it is totally fine to swap it out for something that you would actually wear. I hope you enjoyed seeing this little edit to my spring and summer capsule wardrobe. If you're interested in any of the pieces that I have featured, I will leave a link down below. I'll also link the original video in the cards above if you're interested in checking that out. And make sure to keep on watching because I'm gonna do a quick try on of all the pieces I've swapped in and the new additions. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave me a comment down below. Share your thoughts on whether you're strict or flexible with your capsule wardrobes. I'd love to hear from you guys. As always, thank you so much for watching and supporting this channel. It really means a lot. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!